Hi, I'm Ethan. And I'm Will. And, and this, this is your Friday, Friday newscast. Sixth grade open house was last night. Let's go to an interview with one of the sixth graders. I'm excited for Bachelor Middle School because of cheer, um, and freedom, like no walking in line, chorus, swimming and diving, Spanish, and a whole bunch of parties, fun parties, and a bunch of other stuff. Eighth grade field trip is coming up on May 17th. Let's go to an interview with Ms. Martin for more information. What is the eighth grade field trip? Um, the eighth grade field trip is on Wednesday, May 17th. Where are they going? Um, we're starting um, by going to Indianapolis. We're going to start at the IMAX Museum where we'll be watching Extreme Weather 3D. And then they'll be going to the Indiana State Museum and the NCAA Hall of Champions. And then we'll end over at the Indianapolis Zoo. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks. I'm Isabel. And I'm Callie. And, and this, this is your Bulldog, Bulldog Sports. Track's mock meet was canceled on Monday due to storms. Let's go to an interview with the runner to see how this season is going. How is the track season going so far? It's going good. Everyone's been going out and doing their best. What are your goals for this season personally and as a team? To do the best I can and to win county. Thank you. Thanks. Hey Callie, have you heard about the NCAA March Madness Tournament? Yeah, great job to North Carolina who's this season's national champion. Now, now to your Bulldog feature. Salutations fellow Bulldogs, I'm Aiden. And I'm Ryan. And, and this, this is, is your Bulldog feature. Last weekend the band, orchestra, and choir traveled to Columbus for ISMA. The band and orchestra won gold and choir won gold with distinction. Let's go to an interview with a choir student. How do you feel like you did at ISMA? I feel like we did really well and we practiced a lot. How do you feel about getting a gold with distinction? I'm really proud that we got gold because we tried our hardest and that's the best score that we can get. Significant job, Bulldogs. Congratulations to all 7th and 8th grade ALP students that competed in National History Day. Now I'm going to interview with one of the qualifying state members. What was your NHD project about? My NHG project was on um, Harriet Beecher Stowe's book, Uncle Tom's Cabin, how it impacted America. How did your project do? I, I did really well because I am going to stay in May. How did Bachelor do as a whole? We actually did pretty good. There's about like 12 or 13 of us, I think, are advancing to state. Thank you. Our utmost stakes goes to Larissa. The book fair was going on throughout this week. Let's go to an interview with Ms. Burkhart. When does the book fair end? Today is the last day for the book fair. We'll be packing it up seventh period, so if you have any last minute purchases to make, make it in before we pack up. What do the proceeds of the book fair go to? All of the proceeds for this book fair go to our bachelor school library, so we use it to purchase books for you. What happens if you forgot your money today? If you forget your money, and it's the last day, so you can't shop here, there's a link in the announcements where you can click on it, and you can shop all through the weekend from home, and the books get delivered to our school, and I will find you in your class and bring them to you as soon as they arrive. Thank you. Much appreciated, Ms. Burkhart. And now to the segment where your brain will be trained. Skirt! <laughs> and now to your brain trainer with Mr. Jersha. What's up, Bulldogs? Mr. Jersha for this week's brain trainer. So this past week was the start of the Major League Baseball season. So I have a baseball theme question for you guys. So approximately how many baseballs are used every single year in Major League Baseball? On Saturday it will be a low of 50 and a high of 65. But on Sunday it will be a low of 60 and a high of 76. Have a good weekend, Bulldogs. Tryouts are April 14th. Hope you're ready. South Volleyball Open Gym started last week. The times are Monday and Wednesday from 3.30 to 5. You need to get on bus 19 or 64. Done!